Hello boys and girls. Today we are going to do our project one. Actually it's more like a project one A. But let me bring it over what we are going to do. Uh, you guys know how to get to Tinker Tinkercad. You're going to go to 235 You are going to go to eighth grade. You're going to go to the bottom bottom link and click on that. Your username or nickname in this case is your first name 235 and that should get you in it, it, it's a first thing we're gonna do we are going to go back to the home page and we are going to create a new design we are going to come up here and here's our work plane we're going to come up here this is always going to be the first thing that we do we're going to click on that and we are going to name today's project Project 1A because we started last week and we got interrupted with that meeting. The next thing we're going to always do, we're going to come down to this corner, edit grid. We're going to change it from millimeter to inches, update grid. Now this is each of these squares are one inch and those little squares within the squares are an eighth of an inch. Okay, the part we're going to work with today in the theme of uh, Valentine's, we're going to pour heart out. We're going to put it up in the left hand corner. And remember, you can roll in and out to get a better view. So these white little um, squares on the corner, they're called handles. So we're going to click on this handle, the handle in the bottom corner, and we're going to change this dimension to two and a half inches, 2.5. 2.5 and we're going to make give it a height of one inch okay that is our outline of our our heart our box we're going to be making um but now we need to pull another heart out we're going to be using four different hearts in four different ways so we're going to click on this and this one we're going to make a little bit smaller because we want it to be the cutout, the hole for the center of this hole, of this solid. So I'm going to click in this handle. And we are going to go 2.2 on both directions. Whoops, 2.2, and we will leave it at one inch height. Okay. And the tricky part here is we're going to click on that piece again, and if you look up here, it has a solid or a hole, and we're going to make it a hole. And it looks a little transparent. So I'm going to click on that heart, on that transparent heart, and I'm going to go to this cone. We're going to lift it off the work plane. So we're going to start moving it up. And it gives you the dimension. And we want it to be point one two five. And now we're in position to put these two pieces together. And I'm going to drag it over, but to be approximately uh, in the center of that heart. And then I'm going to click and drag. I keep on, people keep on struggling with this. It does not have to be precise. Uh, some people just click on it, hold the mouse pad, um, uh, left, back, left button down, and drag over it. We're going to al align these parts. So we're going to align, it looks like this, oh, here it is. I see, see there's three on this side. We're going to go for the center one. And there's three on this side. We're going to go for the center. And once we have done that, we can group it together. And now we have a hollowed heart. Oh, that sounds romantic, a hollow heart. Okay. Now we're going to make the, the, the lid for this. So we're going to pull out another heart. And this one is going to be the same size of as our original shape. Now, if you notice, see, I couldn't see this bottom measurement down here. I just rolled out a little bit. I'm going to change that to 2.5, change this side to 2.5, and we want our width to be, um, the, our uh, x, our z axis to be 0.125, an eighth of an inch, we want it to be an eighth of an inch, that's pretty much the, the same as the wall up here, All right, now we're going to pull out another heart. Now we're going to make it the same shape as the hole up here. So I'm going to click on this handle, and we're going to make it 2.2, 2.2, .2. 2 
and this height, this z axis, we're going to make, whoops, we are going to make 0.25 quarter of an inch. That was right there. I didn't get that. 0.25. And that was just about done, folks. Uh, the class made this very difficult. So I'm going to slide this over on top of this heart. And I am going to put a rectangle around both of them. I'm going to align. I'm going to align it this way on the X axis and on the Y axis. And then I'm going to group. And there we have it. We have a heart that um, has a top on it with a little space for it to put little presents in. If you have any problems with this, and uh, you can come stop by the classroom, I'll give you a hand. All right, good night.